Well, hello again to all the boys and girls out there in YouTube land watching Georgia Bear Views. Back at you today with another one. And what I am looking at is regular coffee Imperial Cream Ale. This beer is 12% alcohol by volume, 20 IBUs. It is from Carton Brewing out of Atlantic Highlands, New Jersey. Proudly brewed and canned by us at our brewery in our town. I have ne never had a beer from this company before. Kind of surprised I was even, even able to find it, uh, being that it's a New Jersey craft brewery. They had a single at the Growler shop the other day, so I picked it up. One interesting thing, well, it has a little description on the side, which I'll go ahead and read off. Uh, it won't take me too long here. I just thought it was interesting. It says, a classic Jerseyism is regular coffee. Here, when you order a regular coffee at any place you trust to make a pork roll and cheese, you get a paper cup of coffee with milk and two sugars rather than a black coffee that hasn't had the caffeine removed. We added a coffee blend from our neighbors at Fair Mountain Coffee Roasters to a high-gravity golden cream ale, contributing our milk and two sugars for an elevated version of classic plain coffee. Drink regular coffee because running over a black beer with coffee is no way to get things done. All right. It was $3.99 for the can, 12% alcohol. If it's, you know, a good beer, I'd say that it would be worth it. Let's go ahead and give it a pour. It's a hazy cross between an orange and a blonde color. I think it would be blonde normally, uh, the, the base Imperial Cream Ale. But the addition of coffee gives it a little bit darker appearance. There's some nice streaming bubbles going up the glass. Uh, about a half finger's worth of head, which is already dying down. It smells really nice. I'm not picking up on any alcohol at 12%. I am picking up on some of the coffee. Some nice malt character as well little sweetness. It smells very malty. The coffee is definitely there, but it's not the only thing I'm getting. It's not super strong on the coffee. It's just a light coffee note with some nice malt character. Some toffee notes. Caramel toffee. It smells really good. I'm not picking up on any hops. 20 IBUs. Maybe we'll pick up on some of that uh, once, you know, get into the beer a little bit. And I'm sure there'll probably be a little bit of bitterness from the coffee as well. All right. So a pleasant smelling beer. Without further ado, let's get into this brew. Cheers, guys. Coffee. A nice breadiness in the middle of a sip. Lightly toasted bread notes. Some definite caramel sweetness. Not super boozy, but you can definitely tell that this is a higher alcohol beer. It is slightly warming going down. Body is medium, carbonation is medium to almost high. The finish is relatively refreshing, crisp from the carbonation. It's kind of a wet finish, though. It's not a really drying finish. The coffee is it's there, but it's actually, once you get through that initial burst of coffee, I'm getting a lot of the cream ale characteristics. 
there's a sharpness to this beer that's really kind of difficult to describe. Um, it almost has like a malt liquor character to it. Not cloyingly sweet, but there's some definite sweetness coming through from the malt. If you've ever had Genesee Cream Ale, take that beer and just amplify it by about 50. That's what I'm getting with the flavor and then a touch of coffee. They definitely didn't overdo it with the coffee, though. I've got some nice burps coming up here, too. Very carbonated, like I said earlier. It's a very enjoyable beer. Um, it's a great cream ale. The coffee's not overbearing. And the 12% alcohol is relatively well masked. Although, it's there a little bit. The more I drink on it. Carton Brewing out of New Jersey. Never had a beer from them. I'd like to try some more if I can get my hands on them. It's a good brew. I'm going to go 89 out of 100. It's a B plus. Um, normally I would never say this, but I could have actually used a little bit more coffee with this. The sweetness, although not cloying, it's definitely a little bit more on the sweet side. Uh, that could be from the alcohol, could be from the malt, could be a combination of things uh, because it is a cream ale and typically you brew cream ales at higher temperatures so you get a, a sharpness, a, a twang that you don't get with other styles. Definitely getting that twang. It's not off-putting, but the tw this would be better probably with a lower ABV. 12% is almost a little bit too high for this style. I would say... Between 6 and 8% would have really been good for this. Kind of toned it down a little bit. It's it's good, though. It's great. An 89 out of 100, B+. Plus, I would definitely recommend it. I just bought the single, like I said. So it's enjoyable. It's got some good flavor notes there. Um, but it's not blowing my, you know, not knocking my socks off either. But it's a great beer, nonetheless, so I would definitely recommend it if you could find it in your area. Regular Coffee Imperial Cream Ale from Carton Brewing Company out of New Jersey. So that'll do it for this beer review, guys. Hope you're all having a great day. And until next time, everybody, cheers.